This is the utility bays. The front one is for the black and gray water dump. The second one is for the propane. The back one here is for shore hookup, outdoor shower, cable hookup. The rear doors open out. You can flip the hinge and roll them all the way back for enjoying the breeze. The bench couch will roll down and make into a king size bed. You have an out exterior awning that is controlled by electrical switch inside. Switch. This controls the awning. You have privacy curtains all the way around for the front windows, the windshield, side windows have shades. They also crank over for ventilation. You have a roof hatch that opens to allow fresh air with a fan. Uh, AC. Microwave, microwave convection oven. A propane electric heater. Three-way refrigerator. You have a sink, counter space. If you like the Java stuff, you got a coffee maker, nice two burner stove, propane operated controlled for usage. Uh, there are seat belts that can be attached so you can drive with three extra passengers back here if you need to. Uh, you have flat screen TV with a digital antenna that can be cranked up and down out in the wilderness if you want to use it. You have the DVD set up. That's a tray for the microwave in there. And that's where your books and stuff that you will need if you need them while you're on the road for anything, any information you might need for the air conditioning. There's your AC, uh, not AC, but your uh, temperature control if you're in cold climate. You have wrap around speakers and reading lights as well as ambient lights all up underneath the cabinets and whatnot in the cabinets will be your tiles your blankets rags and stuff or face rags you have a complete interior bathroom front step flush and if you use the curtain and whatnot you have a internal ventilation fan and switch to turn the fan on when you plug it up to shore power or a generator and you can use it as a shower or a vanity <clears throat> <clears throat>